at Hampel is here, folks. The road to Cologne really gets going. And you can hear it. Now Brian Monte, the left back, on the ball now. Gets it from Scuba, tries to get a bright start. But that goes Zagreb's way. Nice set. The ball on the empty switch into the centre. And it's a save down the other end as well. Um, and looks to come out and block that 5-1 defence. It creates a space down the right-hand side on the first penalty. Up against Mandish in goal and boos and whistles around Arena Zagreb, but it does diddly squat. Uh, Stash places that one past the keeper. That's Kavcic in the centre at the beginning of this one. Serna drops on the outside. Nice bit of play there by Zvonimir Serna. Drops the shoulder. And beats the... Swept up by Skuba. Brian Monte, he's clean through this time, and pure power in that one. Not much of a jump to run as well, who'll go in as the second line player. Kuss, oh, nice ball, beautifully tied, but a save by Bolzanger. That'll really hurt because the setup play there by Zagreb was fantastic. Thinking about the empty switch there, but Scuba lays it off eventually to Valentin Port and patted away by the keeper, Mandic. Once again, staying very strong on his line. Reading the shot well and for Conan. Koss, is he through himself? The ball spills away, he's not. And Achinovic on the counter. Ah, oh, well saved again. But it's thoroughly frustrating for the home side. Zagreb with two on to. Port thinking about the shot, lays it off to the line instead, and that is much better by Veron Nachinovic. And it's a two-goal lead, the first free lead of the day from against one. Lays it off, back again, Luka Klaritsa, and it's well defended, counter-attack opportunity, this time laid off to the wing, and a nice little finish there by Yanis Len. Veron Nacinovic again away like a flash on the counter-attack, good timing from him, good passing by... At the corner throw, tight angle for this shot, it comes off the post, rebound picked up by Conan, and away, come on Pellier again. Monte goes out to the right-hand side. Aggressive defending there from Zagreb. They step out to nine meters. Scuba fakes that, shooting that at the moment. A nice move, and again saved. But you have to say, in that situation, he probably should have done better. Over the halfway, back down the other end now. Ah, it's really good defending. Line counter-attack from Montpellier. He's through, and saved by Matt. Monte, that one's high. Late challenge, and the referees notice it. Much to the dismay of the Zagreb bench and... Sweep up the floor and we go again. Monte lays it off to the wing and a break. Ball to the right-hand side. Sweeps it off to Koss. And Paul, he doesn't know. Poor high challenge on him and a two-minute suspension. Scuba loves this kind of space. Laid off to Monte instead to the wing. Oh, it's not a good pass, though. There's on the scoreboard, and they're barely doing that. 14 minutes of play, 4-1. Serna lays it off. Ah, that's much better. Straight out of the tie, Klaritsa. He gets his first goal of the day, and how desperately did he and Zagreb need that, but it's been cancelled out immediately. Dagger Sigurdsson, who undoubtedly be watching this one, also with Veron Nacinovic on the opposition team to enjoy and uh, he won't be enjoying that one though that shot saved but I feel like we need some moments of magic from him he lays it off to Klaritsa Serna packed in in the centre of that defence but they find space eventually and win the penalty Chupic the right winger taking this first penalty of the day oh what a finish that is as well Ivan Chupic with a glorious little lob over the head of Charles Bolzilger. Time since then. A nice ball. Simone Len at the near post beats the keeper. And an immediate impact from Diego Simone on. And goal given. Yeah, eventually. I think the referees were about to show it. it's never too late, particularly if you can. Get some kind of control and defense. Um, Mandic in between the posters, helping them do that, but nothing he can do. As a playmaker, slash left back alongside Serna. Two big men in those positions. And Svonimir's in mid-air to ping that win in off the near post. He makes his way back. 
Hopefully it's nothing too serious. He couldn't get back. Diego Stimirov weaves his way through the defense, but not until a shot down the other end is denied. It's all happening here. And Zagreb, could they get two goals in quick succession? That'll really get the crowd going. No, they can't. Because Jakob Goyan tried to spin it past the keeper. Kos. That one pings off the post, but it's developing himself as a left back when necessary. Laying it off. Nice ball. A Valentin Port once again. Dancing. Oh, I've beaten this time. Cole Colan left for dead. A beautiful play by Milos Kos. He gets his man. He gets his one two between the ball out to the left wing. In flight. Oh, it's batted wide. Kovacic. Drifts out to the right-hand side. Klaritsa looking for any room to manoeuvre. None there, but there is some now. Off the top of the crossbar and out. He can only blame himself for that one. Nice ball into the line. Len! Oh, and it's clean wide of the goal. Another opportunity missed. The line player is having a stink. Counter-attacking very well in this game. Kos! Oh, yes! Milos Kos. Kos is beginning to cook. Comes across too late, set to port. Stash Scuba. He's through. Oh, nicely done. Takes the hit well, gets that right arm free, and just places it past the keeper. It's really tight game in the scoreboard, but also in the overall approach to the play. And that one absolutely hammered in. Milos Kors really cooking now. Three goals in quick succession. Slovenian line player. He knows how to deal with that uh, short Slovenians, but nothing he could do that time. And I think Suhalesnik could be in trouble here indeed. Gets a two-minute suspension. Empty switch. Koss waiting, hovering down the left-hand side. He's through and lobs it over. Gets the penalty and a two-minute suspension. Who's the guilty party there? Is it Monte suspension? The penalty once again to be taken by Ivan Cupic. Fakes it once, ah, and no, oh, just sneaks it past Bolfanger. Scuba. Port out to the wing. Len, nicely done. Yanis Len waiting, waiting, waiting for the keeper to finally make his move, then just drop the ball over it. Both teams, the players short at the moment. Six on five in this match. This attacking situation. Brian Monte setting himself up at 14 meters for the long range shot. Monte with a scorcher. Exactly what the doctor ordered from Montpellier. Goal number two for Brian Monte. Shot. It all comes to nothing in the end. Dimitrov, tight angle for him, and he can't find a way past Paul Tanger uh, to port. Oh, nice move by Simone, but he took a step. Serna back in. Koss at full speed. Oh, how did it stay out? Brilliant. Brilliant play. Not rewarded with the goal in the end, and that is hard. Instead of one last pass, there's two seconds left. Monte this time over the crossbar. Never will let you go for half time, though. Well, much better performance needed. They cannot rely on the goalkeeping. Cost waiting in the center, but Clarita threw himself and shoots it wide. He stays back in his line, feeling like he can read the power, and uh, he set the wrong way instead. Good finish. Ivan Cupic, three from three. Every single second of the game so far, Valentin Ports. Oh, maybe a bit of luck here. Oh, no. Cost. Waiting in the center, and Scuba. Brian Monte lays it off to Ports. Good movement here, the ball back into the line. Oh, it just falls apart. In the... Oh, they over -egg it a little bit. Finally, laid out to the left wing, and it's put away. Davor Chavar. Oh, that was nervy. Let's see, in a playoff match. Oh, brilliant ball. Ah, oh, it's wide over the top. Expect him to do that in 100 shots. Oh, my days, two in a row. Zvonimir Serna gives Zagreb the lead. Things going from... 
Well saved, but inside defending cold against Zagreb. And the penalty given against Luka Skuba against Mandic. And no messing around there. Nicely done, but it's wide to the left. Oh, Milos Kos doing everything right. But a run ball across the Monte. Scuba! Saved by Mandic and a rebound! Claritza. Second line, but illegally. Sir, you cannot do that. Scuba. Nice pass. Out to the left wing. Pelas! Beats the keeper at the near post. And Lucas Pelas gets himself on the board for this. Kos. Claritza. Serna. Nice ball. Out to the wing. Ah, put away with ease again. A real nice pinging sound once more. Monte, ball slips out of his hands and a chance for Zagreb on the counter. Glavash lays it off to Chavo. Situation. Port, one of just three players. Back into Mont. And a penalty. Diego Simone and Killian. Villamino, Villamino not in the squad today. Stash Scuba is Alex Kavcic. Receives it on the move, keeps the ball moving nicely. I think Zagreb really dangerous in these situations, but the shot a little bit underwhelming by Milos Kos. Monte of Zagreb really going to feel it at the end of today. The They've been prodded and probed over and over and over again and beaten over and over and over again. Diego Simone. Draws the two minutes. Not a chance for him to build up speed, so he keeps the ball moving and shot right down the center. Down the right hand side, lays it off to the wing. Zagreb asleep and they're punished, not getting back quickly enough. And Yanis Len will say thank you very much. Faritza. That's nicely done, tight angle for the shot. But it doesn't matter when you've got pure power like that in the right arm of Milos Kos. Fourth of the day. He's been expensive for us at the Pelas. This time it doesn't work out, but they keep the ball moving nicely. And it's really just a case of when, not if. In comes Chavon as a second line player. Ball into Suholeznik. And it's going to be a two minute suspension. Valentin Port, the guilty party. Man up in the attack. Ball across to nobody. Oh. The end of the tie next week. Monte, Brian Monte, right to challenge oh so well. He takes a heavy fall, but he gets the goal. On, oh, he's down. So now the two men up Zagreb. They need to be smart. Ball out to the right wing. Glavash. Oh, and he just about sneaks it in. Saving his blushes there. And the referee's new. Uh, Brian Monte, two goal game again. Monte, right back at it. Lays it off to Simone. Ah, oh, so good. Gets in the man up situation to do that. Nice movement off the ball. And Luca Claritza. Straight into the action. Off the timeout, just as. Into Scuba. Port, he's through it on the right hand side. And no foul called by the referees. Away comes Zagreb again. Claritza overlapped on the left hand side, not needed by Zvonimir Serna. Finds his way through all alone in the set. Stand up for passive play, skip pass out to the left wing. Ah, oh, that shot is fantastic. That's what it's all about at this level. Ah, the save! Balls on Jair, the rebound picked up by Port. Chance on the left hand side, two in a row perhaps. Yes, indeed. Oh, what a turnaround that is. Lucas Pelas on the double and Imbritza. Ball into the line, and that's much better. Good finish by Patrick Falchuk. Simone Port bounces it over the crossbar. Line a bit slowly by Serna, but it doesn't matter because he goes for himself. He sells them all, the dummy. Oh, and he's in bits. He needs a can. This game. It's going back and forth in two goal swings, out to the wing, and a good finish there. Uh, Yanis Len, he keeps his cool, the winger. Reactive, both he and Carl Conan. Conan left behind, though, Monte. 
Courts. Ball into the line. Oh, what a pass that was, and the penalty to go with it. Scuba and Simone just working their magic. Go deep in this competition. Scuba with another penalty. He hasn't missed so far. He doesn't miss this time. Stash Scuba. A solid, solid performance. In there, Montpellier holding strong. Oh, and a save by Bolzanger. And scored all of his penalties so far. And he scores another one. That one, very decisive. Pass out to Scuba. Oh, it's a good save, but out over the sideline only. Ante Gublovats. Scuba. Out to Port. Cuts inside again. Inside defending. With it. There's going to be a discussion here. Operation. At least. And that's exactly what they do. Zvonimir Serna. Well, every few minutes he comes off injured, but then he comes back in. And he comes up with some... Oh, the pass! Brilliant stuff, and the finish as well! It's absolutely inspired! Big smile on the face of Lucas Pelas. Really gorgeous. Oh, no. Good finish here, and a two-minute suspension to go with it. Lucas Pelas, this time the... Simone! Oh, what is that? From long range, reeling back the years. Serna. A oh, nice ball. Oh, batted away by Demone with a free throw given. Against Remy Demone, who comes out and goes back on his line. Mind games doesn't work anything though. As Ivan Trooper just seen it off putting a little bit and they recycle it. Ball the pass and Bills free. Looking for the attacker foul. Ball goes into the line. He's said, Oh, Remy Debane breaks the hearts of 13,000 Zagreb fans all at once. Much like his teammate has done all back into Diego. He goes a long way around. Ball behind the back is free. Chich. Running the show in the centre, Cos, he's through, and he finds a way through at the near pole again. But oh, oh counter-attack, he had a save. He comes back in, Mate Mandic, and he comes up with him. Shupic in at the moment, at right back, he lays it off. Uh, has to be an attacker foul, and it is. Good call from the referees under the pressure. Oh, just on the clock. Eight seconds. Simone! That's over the crossbar. Will the Beatles spills free? It's Deeber off. Oh, that could be trouble. It's a free throw. Will it be more? I think they were just going to check that it will come up with. Milos Kos against the entire Montpellier team. And it can come up with nothing next week. And now it's...